road trip continues with their first visit of the season to Columbus to take on the Blue Jackets. The Blue and Orange were disappointed in their performance in Buffalo. We'll look for a big bounce back game here tonight. They won 3 2 that game. Anders Lee had a goal, and Anders Lee harassing Panarin there before getting off the ice for a change. Stolen by Jordan Everly. Everly out ahead. He's caught off the bench of the backhand. Kiss the crossbar on its way out of play. My boy chucked the handoff between Panarin and Dubois. Save made by Grace. Rebound. Poke checked away before Panarin could get to it. Back behind the D was Sasinkis. In alone. And he scores. Casey Sasinkis on a breakaway. One nothing New York. That move was remarkable. That was as good a breakaway deke as I've seen in a long, long time. And Two on one developing here. Wierenski rips a shot off the heel of the glove of Grice. That allows Alex Wenberg to give it back to Duclair. Moving to the outside with a shot on Grice. It was rolling over his shoulder, and he fell forward to make sure it didn't continue to climb. Difficult save for Thomas Grice on that tough angle shot. Moves it down low for Barzell. In front is Kunako. Barzell between his legs got the backhand on goal. Drops it at the line. Felino turns it over, and here's another chance. Sezikis on a breakaway. He's in alone, and he scores! Two breakaway goals for Casey Sezikis. A little fake there, and then cup of the, of the puck just to hang on to it, and gets Bobrovsky to open up and slides it five holes. So it's the Blue Jackets no score, and it's Sezikis too. So really taking advantage of some opportunities. Protects and turns. 45 seconds to go in the period. Barzell on the goal line. Bobrovsky down. In front, Kunakel. Rolling puck. They score! It came to Bailey. 3 0. Little Karen, but Bailey sticks down on the ice. Once again, shoot the puck. Something good will happen. And Tom Kunakel does exactly that, even from a tough angle. His shot got through, and Grice made the stop. That one off the outside of the post from a terrible angle from Dubois. Chased after by Ryan Pollock, sent behind for Artemi Panarin. Panarin for Harrington. That shot was tipped. Save, rebound. Price got to the post on Atkinson. Good secondary effort by Thomas Grice. As Atkinson looked like he was ready to tap that one in on the short side. Well, we expected a playoff type game between these two teams. Not a lot of space out there as Panarin finds a little bit of room and Letty deflects it away. And Nunavara's drive goes wide. A uh, golden opportunity there to break the to get on the scoreboard. And Thomas Rice has pitched another shutout, a 3 0 win over Columbus. It's the fourth shutout of the season for Thomas Grice. His magical run continues, and the Islanders lead over the Blue Jackets back to seven in the standings. Well, after the really the first five minutes when Anderson had a couple of pretty good opportunities, Brendan, the Columbus Blue Jackets were shut down. They just didn't get a whole lot going offensively. The Islanders were aggressive when they needed to be, when they had opportunities, and then they were defensive-minded whenever they didn't have control of the puck. So